Murphy, Felipe Esparza, and Marcelo Arguello. Look, the world is complicated. There's war, there's economies. And what's Spanakopita all about? Is it healthy? Is it unhealthy? On the one hand, it's spinach, but on the other hand, it's pie. That doesn't make sense. <laughs> Sometimes you just need someone to explain things to you like you're five, which is how the popular subreddit, explain it like I'm five, makes sense of the world. <laughs> By taking complicated problems and simplifying them to a level that even a child could understand. And it's why we're playing the aptly titled game, Explain It Like I'm Five-ish. <laughs> In this game, I'll present you with a topic or individual that I personally don't get, and task you to explain it to me like I'm around five years old, give or take. First up, Marcella, explain to me the DMV. <laughs> like I'm five-ish. Okay, so the DMV is a place you go. <laughs> to get everything you need for your car to stay out of legal trouble except for the thing you actually need, which is white skin. Oh. <laughs> which you have, you, do you have tickets? No, she doesn't have any tickets. I haven't had a driver's license in like nine years. See? <laughs> <laughs> okay, up next, cuckolding, Morgan. Teach me a thing or two about whatever, oh, right, yeah. whatever the heck this is, I don't know. Not for you. Not for you. Not for you. No, this one's for Morgan. Oh. Okay, uh, cuckold, cuckolding. Um, uh, you know how you feel bad sometimes? Yeah. Well, Daddy likes that feeling. <laughs> cuckolding. this in school, which I'm currently in, but I don't understand it. I'm getting bad grades. <laughs> Tell me about the American Civil War. Can I call one of my friends? You got two friends right here. Oh, uh, the Civil War was started when one side said, hey man, you gotta learn how to read. And the other side said, nah. I'm gonna have sex with my sister. I get it now. I, I get it now. I get it. The Battle of Gettysburg. <laughs> I'm just gonna give you points for saying the Battle of Gettysburg with such confidence. Yeah. yeah. And finally, this is for anyone, buzz in and teach a five-year-old about wealth inequality. <laughs> Felipe! That's when um, you finish your Burger King fries and everybody gets the onion ring except you. You don't get <laughs> Bella, you know how I have money, you, you don't? Well, that's never gonna change. <laughs> Give me your lunch money, you little sack of <laughs> Morgan. Okay, so we, uh, we give you an allowance, right? Yeah. Okay, so imagine if that allowance uh, was a lot smaller for doing a lot harder work. <laughs> the story of my life. <laughs> oh, man. Great job, everyone. You really educated me and were much cheaper than the Montessori school I'm currently enrolled in. <laughs> Take that, Rising Sun Academy, stupid idiots. <laughs> I don't have kids, I don't get that joke. Morgan is in the lead with 3,600 points. <laughs> oh, no. When we come back, we'll be doing a close reading of texts to find some meaning in our empty world. Can God forgive us? Only time will tell. See you after the break. <laughs> 